Welcome to Chat It Up. We have a very special guest, Gina, from pinupsforvets.com. Gina creates awesome, beautiful calendars and raises money for uh, the vets that have given so much of their time and lives and energy to, uh, to our country and to the troops that are still out there today. So, Gina, thank you so much. Thank you. But not to, um, not to sidetrack what you're actually here to talk about, but... I want to be a girl, and I want to find out what goes into making you look like a pinup girl. Oh, like, totally. give us the top three. Okay. Yeah, we want to know. We want to know. So, so we can have calendars. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, th- <laughs> there's there's a few elements that are sort of essential to be a, a, a bombshell pinup girl. I would say the first is a red lip. Um, the, mm. you know, the the sirens and the classic beauties from the 1940s all all did do a, a red lip. And I, I like MAC. Um, Ruby Woo. It doesn't come okay. off on your teeth, which is uh, which is very important. It's and very then I would important. say very important, <laughs> yeah. right? And then I would say the next tip would be to do a kind of like a cat eye winged black eyeliner, if you can see on my eye. Um, and okay. you know you can do kind of any any length, shorter, longer. Longer makes it a little bit more dramatic. Um, okay. I would say the the third tip would probably be the rolled hair, like I have, um, okay. and height. I like height. I I like it almost to look animated and cartoonish. It makes more of okay. a statement. Um, and then I would say kind of the fourth the fourth tip. I usually wear a, a big flower in my hair right here, and that's that's a throwback um, to the nineteen forties okay. pinup girls. Ooh, those are pretty. Those seem pretty easy. All right. Thanks for the tips. Hmm. So Gina, I'm so sad because I love this look and I used to do this look like for Halloween and stuff a few years ago, but then I cut my hair and mm-hmm. so I don't have kids. It's hard for me. What, how, what is the look for short hair? Safety. You can definitely you can definitely do like a finger wave on short hair as well. Okay. Um, which almost looks a little bit more twenties. Um, but you can always go on YouTube and which which I always do is YouTube. You know, a pinup look, that. short hair. Um, you can do really cute headbands. Side parts are always oh, yeah. really good as well. Okay. Um, very classic forties. Oh, that's I have a, a great question. tip going to YouTube. That's a great tip because I need okay. help with that whole finger wave. <laughs> I, I have a question. I want to know where you get your clothes. Are they vintage, like for real, or do you make oh, them? One. They're actually vintage reproductions. So um, oh, cool. there's a, a store uh, in LA that donated all of the clothes from this past calendar called My Baby Joe. Um, there's a line called Stop Staring that I love, pinup girl clothing. Uh, there's another mm-hmm. store called Unique Vintage. So there's definitely a lot of options, um, both on the internet. Um, and storefronts for for vintage reproductions. All right. Thank you so much for giving us the quick guide on how thank to be you. a hot pinup girl. And thank you for being such a beautiful person inside and out and giving back to the vets. All right, thank Gina, you, thanks Gina. for being with thank us. Thank you. Talk to you soon. Mm-hmm.